day 12. <coughs> Back at home, before wet day. Back with the mute again. Just trying to warm it up. I left this in the car overnight. Probably a bad idea. The cat walked into the box. The trumpet box. The trumpet case. Right, <clears throat> thought I'd start with uh, Pomp and Circumstance again. Quite enjoyed that one. And then we'll move forwards. <laughs> Alright, here we go. It's certainly getting easier to be consistent straight off. Like that felt all right. <laughs> As I say, I've just effectively just blown down this to warm it up. Ah, the car. Now my mute's falling out. It's a good day. Right, uh, where do we get to? Swanee River. So next up, Swing Low Sweet Chariot, which has some D's in it. So we'll see. Increase pressure heats you up. <laughs> One second while I let the cat out. Hmm. 
Uh, where's the high bit in here? <coughs> Is that this? those high notes just staying stuck on them. Take me out of the ball game. Mm. Apparently by Albert von Tilsler. Til Tilzer. Tilzer. Albert von Tilzer. <laughs> Good strong American name. <laughs> Dell. 
Do I know this one? Oh, this one has an E. Looks simple, but it has an E in it. Why can't I do that now? every day. All right, what have we got now? The Foggy Foggy Jew by Traditional. Love that guy. Uh, this one only goes up to C. <laughs> So now, oh, now we've got the Sailor's Hornpipe. Apparently, that's got quite a big range. Okay, oh, going up to an E again. Are we going to get anywhere close? Not confident. Not so far pedros and things. This uh, this isn't going to go well. We'll try it. Uh, 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 uh,
So the D caused me more issue than the E did. It's because there was only one E, that's when. It obviously drew my eye as I looked at the music before. And things to be scared of. Don't be scared of it, just go for it. Let's try it again, maybe a little bit slower. Oh, um. Scales going down. I find again, I suppose where my mouth is as I go down, I feel like it needs to be in a slightly different point for which range I'm in. So when you're going down, because like, uh, it's going over like basically my entire range on this, but in one run, like, I haven't got time to change where my mouth is. I don't know how you solve that problem. <laughs> Again, things that will probably improve naturally as I get better. Uh, let's try that one. Mm, do -do -do -do. <laughs> it's that point there when I get to the C. <laughs> then for those lower notes. <laughs> Ugh, do that every time for the C. It's not the C, it's this. Obviously, that's the E that comes next. I nearly did it again. Ugh. A little bit of practice. <clears throat> I suppose a lot of the notes are kind of vague in my head. I did find it fairly intuitive to know which ones were which. I mean, maybe it was from trombone before, knowing like the slide positions. Because um, you're kind of thinking of that one as like, well, nothing is like, closed and then position one, position two, position three, etc. So I know where the harmonics are for that. So it's kind of. It's quite quick to flip over in my brain. I didn't really have to think about it too much, which was nice. <laughs> Sped me up a bit. Um, but yeah, still not happening super quick yet. Obviously not quick enough for me to do that, but my lips aren't quick enough anyway. And again, doing weird fingerings, but because um, what's in your head is there. I suppose because it's moving so fast and the transitioning, you kind of fluff it. Probably the tone is not as good as it would be if my fingering was correct. <laughs> but at least you get through it. Improvements. 
Uh, where are we going? <laughs> one last one for today then. Ooh, well next up was the Star Spangled Banner, but that one goes up to a G, so that is not happening. So we've got Schubert's Unfinished Symphony, which is quite nice. Yes, looks like a nice, yeah. This one looks in a nice range. <laughs> nowhere near as high today, but I had better get it ready for work. <laughs> Nice. Cool. 